Here's the Moto G 5G, the 2022 model. I'm going to show you how to transfer files such as photos and videos directly from the phone to your Windows computer, laptop, or PC using the charging cable. The first thing I want to note is the charging cable that comes with your Moto. It's a USB-A to a USB-C, okay? The thing is some of you guys may not have a USB-A um, USB port, okay? Some of you guys may only have a USB C port. So if you only have a USB C port, then one of the options you can do is you can buy one of these. I'll have a link below, but it's a little adapter, a USB A to a USB C. We can pop that into there. And then you can use your USB C connector in your uh, Windows computer. Okay? Or you can always get one of these cables, a USB C to USB C, if you only have a USB C. Uh, port on your computer. Okay. Anyway, so first thing is go ahead and connect to your computer first. Now I'm going to go ahead and connect my phone. So I'm going to plug this in here and let's see if I get a message here. So I get file transfer and photo. Um, so from here you can tap on file transfer right there. Or if you don't do anything, let's say you don't do anything and then you go to your computer here. And you want to open up your file explorer, that little tiny yellow folder. So I'll open up this folder, and I just want to show you really quickly. So if you go here now, you uh, you click on my or this PC right there. This PC. Now you should see your Moto G5G 2022. Okay. The thing is, when I double click on this, the, the folder is going to be empty. Okay. That's because I didn't touch that file transfer when it popped up in the beginning. All right. So what I'm going to do here now is I'm just going to go ahead and slide down notifications. And then you should see right here it says charging this device via USB. Okay, let's go ahead and tap on that right there. And now it says tap for more options. So let's tap on it again. Now this here will pop up and you can see that they put it on no data transfer. So what I'm going to do is tap on file transfer up here. So let me tap on that. Now this just closed. Now I'm going to go ahead and reopen up the file explorer. And let me just zoom in. Now I'm going to tap on this PC again. And we're going to go to Moto G 5G 2022. And then when I double click on that, now we should see this. Okay, so internal shared storage, which is your um, phone's memory. Let me double tap on that. Now here's the um, all the uh, folders I have in my Moto. So what I want to do for all my photos and videos, it should be under the DCIM folder. So double click on that. And then double click on camera folder. And then you can see I only have a few photos and uh, videos in here. I know that they're photos because it says uh, JPG files, the JPEG file. I know that they're video files because it says in the very front, it says vid, V-I-D, V-I-D, okay? So from here, I can go ahead and transfer this and save this to my um, computer, to my the hard drive of my Windows computer. So what I typically do is I'll just go in the desktop here. I'll right click and make a folder. I'll go down to new, and then I'm going to go to folder right there and then I'll name this folder I'll just name it Moto so you can see right there and then I can just go ahead and um, I can just go ahead and oops let me I'll name that Moto one now I can go ahead and choose whatever file I want and drop it into that folder I called Moto one okay but I'm just going to copy the whole thing here all the videos and photos I have here and I'm going to drag and drop into that Moto one folder drop it right there and just wait for this to transfer it's transferring looks like it's complete so now it should be on my computer let me go ahead and unplug my phone and now this folder moto one if i double click that now here are my photos and videos on my computer now all right pretty simple questions or issues just comment below good luck guys